We know all of us have a story. Some rose to success smooth, others, well, not so much. Javancy Jones's path, well, safe to say, it was the latter. But for the former JSU Tiger, it's something he, as well as his mom, are way too familiar with. <laughs> I could have been dead and gone. The lyrics to the song he sings during workouts just about tells the life story of Javancy Jones. Struggle. I'm talking about from growing up, waking up, not not knowing what you're gonna eat that day, from from sometimes going to sleep with no lights, uh, even though your mother there trying working two, three jobs, but sometimes, you know, lights get cut out. My house burned down when I was in seventh grade, lost my grandmother. Just growing up with psoriasis, uh, not being able to walk in the morning, not being able to move my hands. But the Noxaby County native defied the odds, landing a football scholarship to Jackson State and became a multi-year All-American, leaving as one of the most decorated football players in JSU history. I told everybody I'm gonna be the big linebacker in this class. Following his senior season, 253 players were drafted. His name, not called. For what he not getting drafted was a tragedy compared to how other linebackers have gotten drafted, not only in this year's draft. Last month, hours after the draft and his college graduation, NFL teams flooded him with calls. He went on to sign an undrafted free agent deal with the Arizona Cardinals. To show the kids that no matter where you come from, you get a chance to go to NFL, uh, come from the sweat, come from Knoxville County, kind of, they gonna find you. Stop His mom, Christine Jones, is paralyzed and legally blind. To hear that her son graduated and was NFL bound lifted her spirits in ways even she finds hard to describe. It's something that I can't explain. It's something that I always look forward to. And him graduating and then by the draft being on that night, I mean, it's you know me Along with his mom to see after, Jones also has a two-year-old daughter. You know you're beautiful. Prepping for rookie minicamp, she's added motivation to make his mark. I want to be surprised if he's starting and gets defensive rookie of the year. He's my pick. Sunday, rookie minicamp wraps up for the Cardinals. That's also the date for Mother's Day. Be it hard to top his recent success, when it comes to a gift, his mom has one more request. Have fun, do what you do, and mama love you. My backbone, my supporter, my, my provider. He gave back. That's the type of person he, that's the type of child I raised him to be. Come on, Joe, help me. Yeah, Jones heads to Arizona at 5 a.m. tomorrow morning, and uh, training camp there starts Friday. It will end Sunday and Sunday, May the 14th, just in case anyone forgot. That's the day to honor all moms. So, right. Good luck yeah. to that young man. Good. All right. Yeah. Thanks, Josh.